Right, Mazzy. Yeah, I'm excited. American now. Caravan Direct, this company's called. All luxury, luxury. American uh, caravans. And you know what's really odd about it? What? Like, that's a lot cheaper than our motorhome. Oh my gosh, yeah, I just £32,000 for that. Oh my god. £32,000. Shall we see what you get for £32,000? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> called the Luxury Surveyor by Forest Green. 25 foot 8 inches, 2.5 tonne, only sleeps 2 to 4, that's surprising, the size of it. So what's it like, Mazzy? I could live in this. You could live in I'd this? I'd be happy, yeah. Got a proper, I could lay there all day long, nice leather seats, all this floor space. Yeah. Look at the kitchen area. The kitchen is a proper sized kitchen. Look at the tap. The tap itself's amazing. Yeah, it's only like them ones. Microwave, it? extractor fan. What's this, the fridge? Huge. Yeah. How do you get in it, Maz? Oh. Yeah. Nice big wide fridge and freezer. It's amazing. Hello. Just bumped into Here We Tour, another yes. YouTuber channel. Apparently we walked past on the his, well he was filming yesterday. Yeah, he saw us yesterday. <laughs> I don't know, oh. Wow. Massive wardrobe, this is ridiculous. Americans know how to do it, don't they? I must say. Let's go through to another room. Ridiculously huge shower. Toilet right in the middle, not sure about that in the middle but hey I'm not going to complain £32,000 man lovely bed so good this is everything you could possibly want from a caravan £32,000 Mazzy you should get one no oh, you always get my hopes up you do now, the beauty of it is it's got two doors as well but because it was so wide inside, I thought yeah. one of these where the sides pull out. Yeah, does it not? But it doesn't, you know, like that oh, one there. The sides come out. It isn't. <laughs> it's just naturally wide. Just looking in a few tents at the minute. Just notice this. Outdoor Revolution wardrobe. £80. That's, that's different. I've never seen anything like that before. Mazzy wants me to film a few tenty things. Well, some people might be interested. They're not tents, they're awnings. Awnings. Yeah. Well, the problem with them is they all look the same to me. But I will film this one simply because of the price. That is very cheap. £349. And it's a drive away one, so you can build it, drive your van away and just leave it there. There's your model numbers and etc. Yeah, very good. <laughs> I think it's the ones blow we up as well. Yeah, that's blow up. Yeah. But the ones we were looking at are like six, seven hundred pounds, aren't they? And this yeah. one's only three hundred and fifty. This is a big one. I noticed these wind brakes as well, which the thing I like about them, Mazzy, is yeah. once they're folded up and in the back, you wouldn't even wouldn't take up any space whatsoever. I don't know. You wouldn't. <laughs> You know, it's not something we'd ever get, but I think it is a good idea if you haven't got an awning, just a like, yeah. cheap alternative, maybe. Yeah. So this is very different. Our pod, our pod Euro, by the same company as their mother's Forest River. It's like a, a pod caravan. Very, very light. That's ridiculously light. And this is an X demo, so it's only 15,500. Let's have a look inside. So you've got two bunk beds in there. It's quite spacious, really. I was thinking I could I could actually do this. I could live in this. It, feels, it feels like you have as much room as yeah. we have in our motor home, yeah. really. Yeah, so you've got your shower and toilet combined. Yeah. I don't know, the layout isn't to my... No. Taste, but 
In fact, Mazzy, I think <laughs> I think yeah. this is one of them which pulls out. I think it squeezes in oh, when you're travelling. That oh, bit okay. there, I think, looking at this picture here. Oh, I see, yeah. What have you found? A collapsible kettle. Okay, how does that work then? I have no idea. But it's quite squishy squashy and you wanted to get one of these when we first got our fan. And I know how clumsy I can be and I didn't I knew it wouldn't be a good idea. You forget to take the water out before you collapse it. That's that's the problem. Yeah. But we did actually buy our kettle from one of these stalls at the show. And it was one of our best buys ever. Wasn't it? Not really. It was. It keeps you happy in the morning. Yeah. What? So now we've got collapsible pans. Yeah, which for space, I think the idea is, is amazing. But would, th would this melt? I don't know. I don't know. Well, obviously not. Well, probably not, but that's brilliant, isn't it? When you think of all the space <laughs> taken up in one cupboard just by your pans. 17 Is this pounds. collapsible as well? Yeah, yeah this one's Frying pan. Pounds. And a saucepan. Saucepan. And another kettle. Look! What is it? It's a cup holder. Maybe we can do something with it. What? Cup holder. Oh, I see what you mean for the yeah, front of the cap. Yeah, because we, we, we don't have places, do we? Yeah, Wonder where we could clip it. It's not a bad idea, but you know, while you're looking at that, I've found some else. Oh no! This gorilla glue, super glue, super glue gel, oh. gorilla tape, oh. gorilla epoxy. Go on then, one more caravan type thing. £37,499. Two to six berth. Flagstaff super light. This is the one, babe. Oh my god, it's so oh lovely. Oh my god, look like at this. I can dance while cleaning and everything. <laughs> oh no. Look at the kitchen. That's ridiculous. It's bigger than any kitchen I've had in a house. I know. And look at the lovely cupboards on the yeah. fridge. Massive fridge, yeah. Massive, Massive oven. Okay, yeah. Again, an extractor fan. Is that as big as it looks, that sink? Oh, gosh. It's like a yeah. double sink. Oh, it, is. it is a double sink. Wow. Lovely seating area. I love the colours in here, it's very nice. Well, I'm not keen on not keen on this bit, but the wood effect's nice. Oh, it's beautiful, baby. And then you've got the bed. Oh, let's go into the toilet first. So you've got your sink, big shower in there, and your toilet. It's huge, isn't it? That's an unusual way of flushing a toilet, look. I've never seen that. <laughs> Have you seen that? Yeah, a little <laughs> lever. The Big bedroom. wardrobe space is in the bedroom. It's massive, isn't it, babe? Nice bed. Yeah, I like this a lot. A very lot. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're never, <laughs> ever, ever getting a caravan. What, Just to let you know. Oh. You know, we can look at them and show them to other people, yeah. but we're not. They are very nice, though. As soon as we get a caravan, everyone's going to call us gypsies. I know they are. <laughs> now we saw this yesterday, didn't we, Mazzy? I, I think it's the same one, yeah. Oh, it is the same one. Is it? Oh, it's so cool, isn't it? It's really good. It's different, I'll say that much. Right, Mazzy, I want to do a review on this one. Yeah, why? <laughs> because I like them. I like oh, okay. globe cars. Yeah. I'd like one myself, I really would. Yeah, yourself. <laughs> so this one's £48,395. Not sure which it is. It's a globe car. Globe Star 600L. <laughs> I just like the look of them. I think they're really stylish. Blimey, this wind is getting yeah. atrocious. <laughs> okay, the one thing I don't like about them is the dark wood inside. They all seem to have this dark wood. 
I don't like that bed set up. We don't like the shower in the middle, do we? No. That's tiny. Tiny uh, hob as well. That's so neat, big enough for a bag of tea bags. Yeah, that's not special. <laughs> In fact, we don't In like fact, it, do we? Let's just go. We don't yeah. like it, do we? Yeah. I'll show you one you might like if you don't like the colours of this one. Okay then. Yeah, well. Where are you taking me? This one? This one there. So this is £56,495. Auto Sleeper Kemerton XL. I like the colour, I'll give it that. Yeah, you might like the colours inside as well. No, I can see it from here. That's girl blue. <laughs> it's girl blue it's inside. Kind of We're not healthy, getting that. Isn't it? I don't like it. I don't like it, Mazzy. It's all seats. You just walk straight in and it's seat, 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 seat. It's just all seats. Where's the actual things which are useful? It's longer than it looks from the outside. So that's the toilet at the back. Okay, I'm definitely not going to knock the shower. And the toilet at the back, that's really good. So we close that and you've got a microwave, you've got a microwave up there. Oven hob there. Reasonable storage, lots of storage there. Big fridge, this is a lot bigger than it looks from the outside, isn't it? Yeah, this is good, I like that. There just seems to be so much seating area, yet it's still got everything you need in the back. I suppose this would be for a table, wouldn't it? This yeah, thing? you'll have a table yeah. somewhere in here. Yeah, that's not bad at all. Deceivingly big. So next on his list, I think, will be this one. I do like the goldy coloured ones. Yeah. It's uh, an Auto Sleeper Warwick XL. 2015. Let's try and get you a price. £44,995. We have noticed quite a few of these next to us. You know, when we're in campsites and things, we'll get a lot of these pull up next to us. And they are nice. Right, this is what we were looking at originally, something like this, but with a table at the back there. Oh, you can have a table at the back. Very comfy chairs, it's like a proper living room settee, is that? It is that fit nice, isn't it? And I do like the back of the window. Yeah, this is the XL. So it's then for 6.3. I've got to see if we can get on the drive next I'm not sure what I think of this knobbly work surface, that's a bit odd. Not keen on that. Small microwave. Where's the toilet in here? Yeah, it's quite good. Oh yes. Separate. Separate toilet and shower, which is always a good plus for a van. I do like this for this uh, material. Yeah, it's quite homely. It's very Crazy. nice running throughout. Nice little wood effect front to it. Yeah, it's quite nice. You do get a lot of Preparation area though, I'll give it that. Yeah, that's good. But the bad thing about that is you get a very small sink. What's that? What is that? That's your letterbox. <laughs> Silly me. That's the letterbox. I think it's for kitchen roll or something like that. Yeah. Well, Maz is dragging me into a caravan now. We've got a Bailey Pegasus Grand. Why is she looking in a caravan? I do not know. I'll just get you a price. 25,000 quid. Okay, let's have a look. I'm actually surprised to what this has to offer. Are you impressed? Yes. In fact, that's nice, isn't it? Yeah. Nice, it, lovely the living thing area. It just seems so big. Lovely dining area. Yeah, this is alright, isn't it? Yeah. So look at the Wow, separate toilet and shower as well. Yeah, bathroom's alright. 
Yeah, yeah. Huge wardrobe. Now I can see why people in caravans, Mazda. Yeah, I didn't realise what they had to offer. It's actually all right, isn't it? Yeah, lovely kitchen. This is really good. It's weird because we've been to about five shows now and this is the first caravan we've been in. We've yeah. not looked in any caravans, have we? <laughs> but I'm impressed. In fact, I will go as far to say, and this is true is this, I think, yeah. apart from the American caravans which we've been in, yeah. I think that is the first trailer caravan I've ever stepped foot in in my life. I think me too though, I'm sure, I don't know. Don't get me wrong, I used to live in one, but <laughs> static ones, you know, not a, not a trailer one. I think that is the first time I've ever been in one. They actually give a lot to offer, don't they? More than I thought. They, they, I think they're quite fantastic. They're missing one tiny thing though. An engine. An engine. <laughs> what have you got your eye on? A job for you. I don't know why I'm giving you another job, but yeah. <laughs> you do realise that takes yeah. screw holes. Yeah. I'd be, drilling that in, I'd be screwing that into uh, plastic. Yeah. So once that breaks, you're going to have them all in the plastic forever. Let's get it and we'll contemplate what's what. I think this is what we need. I think this is the worst decision you've ever made in your life. We'll get hey, it. Go yeah, for it. We'll get it. So that's it for the uh, show. Yes. I hope you enjoyed them videos. There were a few for you there to choose from. Um, yeah, we've actually got really tired then, didn't we? Yeah. We could stay, you know, it's only halfway through the day, we could have stayed a lot longer, but it's very tiring walking around these shows. Very cold today, isn't it? Very windy, very cold and windy. So, thanks for watching anyway, guys. Yeah, thanks, guys. Back to vlogs, um, starting tomorrow, so see you later. Goodbye. Bye.